Yeah, sorry about that. Just have to cut it out at some point, why not? How does she get oh yeah, she's going up then. So I need food. Um I still need a crop. Fucking eat it though, I know. I'm hugely behind. Citizens of poor grown. Oh, oh you go, stick. Breaking news, the army is about to hit the rebels hideout in Zatama. Base pass on this warning to them if you can. I guess you have to say which base, because I don't know if like which base. And the military already knows, so it's not really like it's detrimental to it, I, I guess. We followed your plans, your plan, you bastards. It's really stunned to the insurgents have plenty of time to clear out the brothers from the pharmacy too. So, like, is not entirely sure he believes that himself. I mean, with us doing it, surely by the time they told her, they would actually have started moving from land, all things considered. But I guess maybe one of the brothers could have been mad and actually said to me, we don't have anywhere else to go, which would have made more sense. So it looks like they've got something to talk about. Oh, wait, he's got a bio thing. Oh, shit. It was very brave of the pharmacist to share his, pharmacist to share his knowledge of the upcoming attack with us. He put himself at the risk, at risk for the rebel set. Is that something gonna push more forward his um his mental state or like heroism I've, I've got to do this you know my, my life isn't as important as like eight other people's you know and it's really just going to have the influence right i don't know if this is really good for it i mean optimism wise it is and self-esteem wise it is but He's also going to be putting himself in more danger. I mean, well, then again, he's already put himself in enough danger. He's not really going to escalate too much further, I don't imagine. Well, he's only just going to stay more prolonged, which I... I feel like fucking Esma needs more of a talking to than fucking Malik does. There's nothing new. He says before he puts on the earmuffs, he's really going to stop doing that, dog. Like, two. Sure. Nothing of interest, you guys. Know, it's, it's been like fucking two minutes, but. Oh shit, right. Ten minutes. He only, he only snaps to every ten minutes. any news. There's nothing new. Thanks for the update, sir. We did get one piece of news, though, yeah, at least. Maybe there's double of that sometimes. 
Oh, damn, no. no I'm still on Esma. I would have just woken her up. The insurgents have plenty of time to cook me. You've already said that. It's like fucking nail culture. Nothing receipt. He said, There we go. Yes, that's one point. I'm pretty sure. Hmm. Guess not. Pretty lucky to have the whole room in the fucking house and just have that shit though. My god, just like okay. Right, this is weird because um at the pharmacy now, now that I visited, it says there's huge amount of weapons. Maybe the uh rebels had a stash somewhere for it, along with the meds. That'll probably need, you know what I see. Or maybe the military's popped up there and revisit. There's no danger. So Central Square doesn't say any danger, but there he is. Well, unless they've cleared that out, in which case I may actually want to research Central Square. But for now, I'm going to the toy store. This toy store is burned down to the ground, which makes me think this is after the story of the last one. Because what happened in the last one was halfway through, the store was there, and um, something happened, and it got burnt down. And that was kind of a a big plot twist um, device they kind of used there with the um the toy store i know you'll have to buy it play it and see what happens unless i plan to do an outfit with that but i don't think i will i'm not going to say i won't because anything could happen in the future but i don't think i will i've already accepted one too many Fuck, that goes all through the store. Four. I don't remember. 
remember we had the stole look we lost one but i certainly remember it was an old burn down the first time we visited it it was kind of big now that i think about it wasn't it, it certainly had a, a bottom floor didn't it all right looks like someone's just staying there probably that's a rat oh shit oh shit cutscene well, kind of cuts it. Is anyone in the air? Please help me. I'm stuck. I'm falling and I can't get up. So I'm gonna do something to help this guy. I hid in the basement during the bombardment several days ago. I didn't encounter this guy during the last story. So maybe it's kind of eerie? One of the explosions made the ceiling collapse and I got stuck here. Yeah, I think it must be. starving and dying of thirst here. Please help me out. Um, well, I can't help you with food because my character's fucking starving. I'm going to be freezing in a sec. I'm not going to get hit. Look, this is in a building with fucking like half a roof. I cannot help you myself, but I will try to get someone to help you. I mean, you could also just be like military at this point if you back down. Somehow the rebels seem to be bastards to respond very generally. Yeah. Don't know why. It'd be an interesting thing if one of the mechanics was just that it was like 50% that you were alert that, that you helped the military whenever you're making a lot like this, and 50% you helped the rebels, you know? Like, that would be quite interesting, because you're never assured then to help one or the other. There's always the risk of who gets there first, which would really make you think about whether to report something or not. Then you're like, sure, it could help them, but it could, so, could also fuck them up further. And in situations like this, it's kind of like, either way, they're fucked, so you might as well. But, you know, for other situations, it It'd just be interesting, I guess. Why would you even bother breaking that door? But at least I didn't eat up a lot of my time. A box with some woman's personal belongings. Looks like some woman lived here. Interesting that it's nothing that I can steal. You know, like a diamond for trading. I would actually kind of need that, just for the meds. For the food, because my character's fucking starving to death. Fresh and dirty. Diary that ends with a note from a week ago. I've been re it's been really hard since Papa died. It's not easy for a woman alone. I notice how men look at me. 
this guy. Yes, yeah, so this must have been a long while ago. Fortunately, I met my school colleague from years ago, and he promised to look after me, so that must be the guy in the, in the basement. And this woman either left, or she died on the other side. Either way, the spit is pretty tragic for this guy. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's, let's figure out the law, the law of the land, shall we? A scribbled letter reading, I agree that such a pretty girl would make a valuable asset. Let's make a deal, bring it to our little... Oh, that fucking piece of shit. Holy fuck. Bring her to a little establishment, and in return, you'll get some food, smokes, and a free shag once in a while. Unfucking believable. Un. He sold her. This guy doesn't even fucking deserve to be saved. This guy can get fucked. Wait, is... I can actually go upstairs? Okay. I'm a bit locked off. But that guy can get fucked. If anything, I should report him to the fucking military. <laughs> just just give myself a little good side, be like, yeah, there's this guy locked down here, you can fucking kill him if you want. I mean, what a selfish fucking cunt. Holy shit. There's some chicks that I hate, that I'd be happy to see bad things happen to them, but it's like... Jesus Christ. Actually, I might, I might wait a bit because I can use them to trade and I actually do kind of need to trade while I'm starving. <laughs> gonna need so many fucking beds to make me. Can I just get down here? Make a choice actually. Can you not talk to her? No, I can't. I can't talk to this fucking jackass. I was hoping I could, like, bring up what the fuck just happened there and be like, yo, what the fuck, dog? But. Vodka's fucking like a liter vodka. Like, there's no way I'm getting through it all the time. I blacked out trying to do a fucking 750 mil. Uh, I can't actually escape that way, right? What else? Do I have any need to woman? Let's get a full on zoom out here, like, just that. Esmeralda. Dude, fucking place is trash. Even the building behind it is fucking trash. Can I actually get up there? Let's check it anyway. I've got a bit of time. Oh. 
<laughs> Boy. I mean, I, I can't do anything with it because I don't even have a fucking workbench. And you generally find the other pieces to be actually harder to get. You need like two or three pieces. Fucking craft the guy. Okay, maybe she's getting really depressed now. I'm back and I feel like Santa. Just look at that. What do you mean? You're happy that you found stuff? I thought she was depressed sitting down for a second there. But generally when you say you feel like Santa, but... It's not letting me skip this either. Don't really let me skip this and just see what she came back with and shit. Right here we go. Esme has been searching for supplies and brought back some interesting stuff. They're both starving. No buyer, no buyer. Telling to report. Starving as usual. Sad. Slightly sick. She's not here. Okay. Okay. I don't get the option to build a snowman. Uh huh. Okay. Because that is kind of an activity you could do, which I would do just because it makes them a bit happier, generally. But, um. No. It'd be kind of interesting if people could just come by and, like, kick it down and something the twin days. It's kinda of good that no one ever comes to rub you during the day. I'm gonna say no, but then again the lights can generally go out. So only is trapped in a glazed basement. Several people are needed to remove the Deborah. Somebody help him please. I don't really feel like helping them with how much fucking fun it is. But then again, if I don't help it, wouldn't I be just as bad? I mean, this is still my only option. So, why not take this? I mean, it's not story related, so I don't actually have to. But the military is not going to be pissed off about me saying that. So, why not? I'm gonna leave her. I'm gonna leave her for a bit. That guy's such a fucking piece of shit. I don't feel like helping him. Him. Well, I've read the pool. That's my shit. You will make it. Yeah, you should choke her, you ass, to the fucking finish line. Aha, I guess I'll let you not even sit down. Holy fuck. This guy's magical. This guy's like a fucking wizard. Set a pause menu for a second there.
This ain't a traitor. They've got something to give me without asking for anything in return. Okay, interesting. I even have something to say. Probably do. Static Outpost Alpha Delta 3 Year. Report, sir, we've lost our information at the bakery. Our informant at the bakery. Those road broadcasters exposed him. I suggest we locate them and end their medley. Over. Uh. So what I think is going to happen is they're going to try and, like, triangulate our position as we keep broadcasting more and more. You know, kind of figure out where we are. Gosh, she's really sleeping along. Because she's hungry. Fucking. Good news. Oh. Thank me. Thank me. saving my life. Now, my concern is can I have one character eat one and that just kill their starving? Or do I have to have and the other eat the other? Or can I only stop one person starving? Because if that's the case, I mean, with this DLC, it's like either one that dies is fucking game over. We don't really have much of a choice. This is Tasmania on here, but I'm not actually in Tasmania. I don't even remember how I got this. I think my father was staying at Tasmania once and bought it for me. I was like, con, fucking. He had to have been, right? I know why I got it, but it's been way too long, I guess. Still stuck. Fuck. <sighs> I might have to go to the bakery for that. Then again, I've already checked the fridge. I'd rather they were cooked. 
so at least sick. Yeah, they're gonna be so. At least it's not like bonus one and it's not like fucking anything too bad. But I don't think I can hold up much longer. I don't think they're gonna last too much longer. Alright, that's the warehouse. Hang on, what's the time? Alright. 